uh, I heard a lot of great things. A lot of my um, uh, boys already came up here, bless the stage. So uh, it was only right that I, I, I did the same thing. Loved their heart behind the ministry. Didn't know that they've been funding themselves for, for so many years. Um, so that even encourages me even more, uh, just going out of faith. But um, yeah, really encouraged by everything I saw tonight, everything I heard, and most importantly, man, their heart behind prayer and getting to know the people in the crowd. Yesterday, I just finished recording my project, so I'm, everything is recorded. Uh, we're in the mixing process right now. It is titled Valley of Vision. Um, basically, the concept of the project is just that the way up is the way down. For the Christian, you would think, oh, you know, if I'm on my highest, if I'm on the, the, the tallest mountain, um, this is where I see best. But in a Christian life, it's actually the total opposite. It's not until you hit rock bottom is that where your vision is actually uh, the clearest. So uh, it's called Valley of Vision. Um, it's going to be a seven song project. Um, once the mixing is done, Rapzilla will be um, shooting it out. Uh, directly from their page. They're going to be doing a big promo package with it. Other than that, man, been doing battle raps. So uh, my next battle is April 23rd in Atlanta for battle rap scene that I am currently in. Uh, totally non-Christian. Uh, it's nothing, you know, where it even uh, is welcoming Christian so much, but um, it's everything anti- uh, biblical. So it's, it's this big, prideful, uh, tearing down of the opponent, um, degrading um, uh, vernacular that they use. But uh, me, I kind of grew up watching it. And so uh, I'm a firm believer that the Lord isn't just uh, into redeeming people, but also cultures. So, uh, you know, he takes the dude with the, with the baggy jeans, with the baggy shirt, renews his heart and puts him right back. So currently now I'm actually in the battle rap culture. I do uh, battles in which um, I strategically um, debunk their type of mindset. Um, also uh, sharing the gospel as much as I can within it or even after it. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm currently doing, man. It's, it's, I'm, I started in Tampa, Florida, and it's just been progressing, man. So uh, my last battle just dropped. And uh, other than that, man, you know, looking forward to see where the Lord elevates me in that area. My first battle was against a guy named Problems. And uh, shortly after the battle, um, shortly after actually uh, the event, maybe about a month or so, his brother died. The dude who I was battling, his brother passed away. Um, there was a next event, and um, this never happened in, in, in battle. I don't even know if it happened in battle, period. But we started the event off in prayer, and they decided that they wanted me to come up there because they knew my background. They knew exactly what it was. I mean, you would think after you know defeating somebody in a battle rap, you didn't necessarily want to uh, associate yourself with them. But um, they actually asked me to come up uh, pray for the event, pray for their, um, their loved ones and, their, and, and, and the people who actually were affected by losing a brother. Um, and with that, man, I've just been able to build relationships with them. So uh, you don't get, I don't necessarily get to see a direct impact while I'm there, but afterwards, man, the residual uh, effects are, are just, you know, outnumbering what, what I necessarily can uh, see right now. So I'm excited, man. I'm excited for what already happened and what's going to happen with that. I think my main message is uh, to understand that Jesus is in control. I know that uh, we definitely living in a time where uh, questions are just arising, but um, I think that there has been one that has came and gave all the answers. Um, the answers are here, man. So uh, look to the Lord. Do not look to yourself. I did that for plenty of years. I looked to myself to try to, try to save myself, try to make sure I was good enough. Um, however, though, the Bible just flips that mindset. So please continue to look to Jesus, continue to trust in the word, and rehearse the gospel to yourself, man. This is Loso. I was dead in sin. No way in the world I beat that. He preached facts. To my heart, I repented on my kneecaps. Glory to the Lamb. See, it's true. Yeah, I eat that. The word of God echoes. It's only right that I feed back. See, he's hot dog. Y'all need a catcher. Forget what y'all must have heard. He's the best, bro. All them sour crowds in the audience. See what I kind of meant?